Hi, I'm Alicia De La Garza with Cal OES. We're here at the State Operations Center where our teams are actively monitoring extreme weather incidents across the state. We are still experiencing extreme heat, and with that, another flex alert. So after 4 p.m. today, please limit your energy use as much as possible. And with that heat, we are experiencing increased fire activity across the state. Governor Newsom declared a state of emergency and obtained a fire management assistance grant for the Mosquito Fire in Placer and El Dorado counties and the Fairview Fire in Riverside, which helps ensure the availability of funding and vital resources to suppress these fires. Through the California Fire and Rescue Mutual Aid System, Cal OES has deployed over 120 fire engines and more than 1,200 firefighters to help combat fires and keep communities safe. And something you don't hear too often in California, a tropical storm. There's rain expected this weekend from Tropical Storm K, so Cal OES is pre-positioning mud and debris flow staff and equipment across burn scar areas in Southern California. We ask you to stay vigilant the next few days. Make sure you have a family emergency plan, put together resources for your family if you need to leave quickly, learn the best evacuation routes, don't walk or drive through moving water, watch for mudslides and burn scar areas, and if told to leave, don't wait, evacuate. Cal OES continues to work closely with local, state, and federal partners to provide California vital resources during these climate-induced incidents. To see more resources, visit our website, caloes.ca.gov, and follow us on all of our social media platforms.